Coming to you from the Windy City. Welcome to Let's Talk Shop, a podcast about all things cloud and enterprise tech. Listen to insights and guest interviews with IT thought leaders and professionals. Now, here's your host, Elias Kinesar. Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Let's Talk Shop. Today, it is my great pleasure to welcome Matt from Juniper in the reInvent Future Frequency booth. This is a cool booth, isn't it? It's an amazing booth. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Uh, it's my pleasure. Matt, you're with Juniper. What is your role? What do you do exactly for Juniper? Yeah, thank you, Eli. I, I oversee software portfolio and software transformation for Juniper um, globally. Amazing. So we're at reInvent. Why don't you tell me a little bit about what you know, how Juniper and AWS kind of work together? Where are the synergies? Yeah. I, I mean, great question. Juniper and AWS have enjoyed a long relationship. Uh, we are a longtime vendor of networking equipment and solutions to power the cloud that we've come to love and to deploy all of our world, our digital world in. But we're also a partner. You can find Juniper a plethora of uh, cloud-powered applications for network and for security on Marketplace or through the Cosell catalog. The last and definitely not least, we're also a customer. The SaaS applications from Juniper that you love, like Mist uh, AI, is also running on the cloud that we power ourselves. So you can start to see where that synergy wheel is going, where we are both a vendor, a partner, and also a user of the AWS platform. And who wins? The customer. Customer wins. Yeah, amazing. So Juniper, in my opinion, was very early with AI, with intent-based and all that. But I know today you're focusing primarily on experience first. Why don't you tell us a little bit about what experience first is and a little bit about the tie-in with AI? Yeah, definitely. Uh, experience first networking is a concept that helps us to start with the user and the customer in mind. Quite like our friends at AWS, always working from the customer back in to develop, develop their solutions and their products. And it starts with identifying who the user is of our platform solutions and applications. And it goes from the network operator to the network administrator to the user. Think about a student on a campus watching Netflix over Wi-Fi or a salesperson using a POS scanner uh, when transacting uh, on, on site. And even us here at AWS reInvent23 connecting, streaming, sending emails through Mist AI powered Wi Fi mm. here on site. Nice. Nice. Um, and so, obviously, as we develop this uh, experience first networking concept, we've developed different pillars. One of them, obviously, will uh, rotate around AI. Our Mist portfolio and Mistified portfolio is powered by a large language model and NLP um, uh, AI that allows the network not only to uh, provide extreme visibility from client to cloud, but also keep our users informed all the way of any potential issues, threats, and goes the extra mile of not just warning and raising alarms, but fixing the issue themselves. Yeah. Our customers enjoy primarily the fact that they've enjoyed a 90% ticket, the support ticket reduction just by the mere fact of using Marvis in our uh, MistAI platform. Very cool. But you know, Experience First goes beyond this. We've developed the concept of connected security. We've decided not to have a siloed approach to security because we know the threat is throughout the network from sure. client to cloud and client to data center. And we inject threat mitigation at every step of the way, powered also by our Mist AI platform. Very cool. How does that tie into the intent-based stuff? Does this there tie in? Uh, I mean, there's always a tie-in, right? Our... Uh, we uh, started working with AI before AI became, became AI. That's right. Right. Yeah. So we've developed Marvis, large language model analysis and insight extraction every step of the way in, in our intent based networking. You're referring to the abstract. The abstract. Uh, obviously, this large um, uh, AI um, a platform is actually used throughout our portfolio. It doesn't even stop with intent based networking, allowing us to discover uh, threats and, and discovery on the network. It goes into security and it goes into the larger platform, like the big routers and switches that we're using, MX, PTX, and QFX, through the, the, the use of either our MIST AI platform native on the cloud or Juniper support insight that actually can be deployed both in the cloud and on-prem. Very cool. 
I know you're very busy at reInvent, so I won't take too much of your time. We need to do a full episode to go a little bit deeper on this, but I wanted to thank you for taking the time to, to stop in and tell us a little bit about what Juniper is doing with AWS. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. Enjoy reInvent 23. You as well. All right, take care.